Grab your peanuts and popcorn. Baseball is back. That's right. The boys will be getting back out on the diamond this week. And while we may not be able to join them in the stadium, there's plenty of action to be had from the comfort of your home. There's no better place to get in on the action than with DraftKings Sportsbook, America's top-rated sportsbook app. To celebrate baseball coming back, DraftKings Sportsbook is offering free bets for every home run your team hits. Taking advantage of this Grand Slam offer is easy. All you have to do is place a pregame bet of at least $25 on your home team, and for every home run they hit in that game, you get $5 worth of free bets. Bet the team. They hit the home runs. Double down. We get more money. I like it. Additionally, DraftKings Sportsbook is offering all new users a sign-up bonus up to $1,000. Anything for free is for me. I like that offer. Don't worry if baseball isn't your game. DraftKings offers great odds and promotions on all sports ranging from ping pong to basketball. If you want to bet ping pong, you can do it. DraftKings Sportsbook is US based, making it safe, secure, and reliable. Gotta love that. Plus, it's easy to deposit and withdraw your funds whenever you want, which is a huge thing. All the books want to take your money. Are they going to give you your money when you want it? DraftKings will. Download the top-rated DraftKings Sportsbook app and use code JOMBOY when you sign up. For a limited time, all new users get a sign-up bonus up to $1,000. That's code JOMBOY, J-O-M-B-O-Y, to get your sign-up bonus up to $1,000. Only a DraftKings Sportsbook. Must be 21 or older, New Jersey only. Bonus compromise of a first deposit bonus and a first bet match, each up to $500. Deposit bonus requires 25 times playthrough. Restrictions apply. See DraftKings.com slash sportsbook for details. Gambling problem? Call 1-800-GAMBLER. I kind of want to go to the final out. If you got some time, I just want to see it. Yeah, let's do it. We'll taste it. Let's taste it right here. God, God, this is crazy, man. Section 209 going nuts. Oh! Okay, the lazy flat. Oh, no, kind of a. No, no. Kind of, I thought that was no, lazy no, flat ball. That, that was not a, a lazy flat ball. That was the end. That's EPAT's first game in left field. Oh, oh my gosh. First game ever in left field. All right, Gabe's up again. Oh, oh. Come on, Jim. Come on, Wolfie, sing back there Are for you me. Are you kidding me? You, you want to know why? Gabe and Jim go way back. Bro. Boys from Valley the Valley Boys. Uh huh. Unbelievable. Um, yeah, oh. I, I need to get them both on the pod at the same time <laughs> to hash this out. That was a strike, especially <laughs> in this situation here. All right. No love. So it's 1-0, right? All right. 1-0. Back Hello. with it. Back with it. Double up for me. I, right. I love that. The golden yeah. rule? You're going to throw the second one better? Let's go. Mm-hmm. Got that feel. Fuck it. It's four nothing. You're I've going inside even, now. I guarantee it. Yep. I've never even seen the ninth inning before. See now, right there. You see how he's here? He's looking out. Look at that front foot. Look at that front mm-hmm. foot. And now look you at know that, what and, he's going to do. The, the upper body movement. Like, come on, that's at 88 miles an hour, and he's not being brushed back because it's coming in hot. He's he's brushed back because he's looking out over the plate. I love it. And you know what his hip's going to do this next pitch. <laughs> going to be leaving early. <laughs> Give an Irish goodbye on that hip. <laughs> All right. Hopefully that's not racist. I don't, I've only used that a couple I'm times a, in my life. I'm Irish. Oh, my God. Jim. Hey, so now, so thank you, Poofy. Thank you. Jim. Uh, unsolicited. Oh, my. Wait, uh-huh. You missed the spot, but... But let's check it out. Let me see if I can get it up. That's a straight. There goes Landon again, rodeo clown me right out of yes. the zone. He he missed out for you. But if he's set up over there, Jim's fucking. That's Jim, strike two. Jim singing. He's singing. Yeah. So so now this is oh where. Oh my gosh, three. This one. is where you need to know. Just because of the like mind state I was in all day long throughout the game, whatever. In my head, Pluvi, at that moment, that's a strike. Okay. That's a strike. So in my head, the count is now 2-2. And that's the reality that I'm living in. The count is now 2-2. Wait, 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 wait. Yes. In your head. In my head. That's the reality. In in my head. So I'm now taking this 3-1 signal from Landon as if the count were 2-2. Like for real, for real? Or you're just like, no, I'm approaching it like it. 
no, no, no. I, because it was such a good pitch in my head, I, and what, this is the awkward moment is like after the game there were, you know, I'm talking back and forth to the, to the guys on the radio and they're playing the call over and they're like, uh, King Korak, just a velvet voice for the A's <laughs> and the three one. And, and I go, Ken, the three one, have you been drinking? And he goes, <laughs> Whoa, what are you, what are you talking about? And I'm, it was two, two. He's are like, you kidding me? Yeah, and he's like, no, Dallas. It was 3-1. I was like, really? <laughs> Dallas, can you imagine if you threw a ball and you're like waiting for the ball back because you think it's going to be 3-2 and Gabe's running down to first base? Bro, I had no idea. Holy shit. I had no idea. Okay, that gives this whole I had no clue. last pitch yeah. a, a new life. So, anyway. so – and, and here's the thing is 3-1, like I'm going 3-1, I'm throwing a changeup. Wow. No, absolutely. If it's 3-1, That's I'm throwing pitch. a change. Yeah. Get back in the count. We contact it best. We're up by four. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like he's not going to hit a five-run homer. I'm all good with it. All so good with you're, it. You're confident to throw that pitch for a strike. Oh, yeah. Like, More like, I, like if And if anybody would ever question that, I would tell you to get in contact with Coach Doug Jumale at American River College in Sacramento, California, and he will tell you that one of the questions he asked me right before I threw my bullpen at the tryout was, what's your best pitch? And I said, change it. And he said, change piece. count three, two, game seven of the World Series, bases loaded. What pitch do you throw? And I said, change up. And I said it as I was walking off to go get on the mound. Like there was no fucking hesitation. No. I love that. I love that. So that's, how, that's how I feel. So it's 3 1. So if it was 3 1. 3 1, 2 2, whatever. You know. Yeah. Let's see what we got. Freaking A, Dallas. You kidding me? <laughs> that is hilarious. Everyone's standing up like they're so nervous. I mean, if you could just tell with their faces, here we go. Pennington. He's got it. Right to Cliffy. Oh. He did it. Dallas Losing my mind. Let it ride right out. Look at this, baby. Holy cow. He did it. How does that make you feel right now? Let's go back. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, let's, let's check this pitch out, too, while you gather your emotions here. You went heater. Yeah, heater. Well, so – because it's 2-2. Two, two. So I'm like, Landon goes change up, right? And I'm like, no, let's not go change up. Let's go let's fast. Save that for if we right. get to 3-2. Because if it's 2-2, two, two, he's sitting soft and he's sitting away and he's going to hit that pitch. And I can't give that pitch to him right now. 2-2, two, two, I can ball in and get to 3-2 and then give him the change up that he might be anticipating. But at 3-2 probably isn't sitting on no and i'm gonna win that battle too for people who don't really know i mean two two and three one are completely different counts i mean (laughs) so so you're thinking it's two two you're trying to trick him with the heater Mm -hmm. he's knows it's three one he's like i'm gonna get a heater right here maybe change ups in the back of his mind a little bit but you gave him the pitch he was probably looking for Mm -hmm. he knows you don't want to walk anybody too you give him the pitch Luckily, or not luckily, I mean, you've been doing it. Hits it right at Cliffy, not too hard. And if there's yeah. any guy you want the ball hit to, it's him. No doubt. Not only because of the sure hands, but the dude has an absolute canyon for Love an that arc. guy. And you're going nuts. I mean, so freaking cool, man. I yeah, love well, how happy your teammates are for you. You know, that's that's a tell of. Well, they, they I mean, man, like, you know how it is. You, you, you bleed and sweat with those group those group of guys and they know everything about you. You know, like I just didn't know, dude, I didn't know what to do. Oh my gosh, man. That's so cool. And, and a lot of those guys, you know, a lot of those guys know how much my grandma means to me. A lot of those guys still reach out and, you know, ask about my grandma to this day. Ben Sheets. Cheater. You're going awesome. right, are you going right to her right now? I, that's what I'm pointing at. And like, I, and I feel but like, like yeah. honestly looking back, I feel bad because like I didn't, I didn't even look any of these guys in the eye, you know. Like, but I was just so like I'm hugging my coaches, but I'm I'm not even 
I'm really not even focused. I just want to get to my grandma. And now I punch Landon in the chest because I... <laughs> and then I think... Oh, there he is. Up, up, up. Steve! Jim Scaling! This is amazing to watch, dude. You're just looking for her. You're like, where is she? You're like, get over here! Yeah. Love it, man. Oh. Chills, bro. There she is. It's so cool. That's why My you do it. Goodness. That's why you do it. Could watch this all damn day, dude. Oh man. And the stand, I mean, everyone's just know. They just know, man. When you're in a when you see a moment like this happening, it's just so special. Well and that's what's uh like not to get all sentimental and shit, but a lot of these fans in this area I grew up with not only as a as a citizen in this community, but the older fans who watched me play in Stockton mm -hmm. and then watched me play in Sacramento, the triple a club, mm -hmm. and then watched me come to Oakland and grow up and take my lumps and get sent down and come back up and ride that <clears throat> roller coaster and, you know, have my day in the sun in front of them at home. And I mean, that's, this is storybook shit, bro. That's what dreams are made of right here. Yeah, like a lot of, I, I, I had, I mean, the road I traveled to get to this point, Ploofy, like as far as pro ball is concerned, I played every step of the way at home. You know, my awesome. a, a ball, I played in Stockton, the, the town I grew up in. And double A was in Midland, Texas. I went to school at Texas Tech. Right That's there. Incredible. Triple A's in Sacramento, where I went to junior college. And I lived in Stockton when I played in AAA. And then once I got promoted to the big leagues, all the way in Oakland, an hour away, I lived in my apartment in Stockton. Uh, I was like, this is crazy, man. You nuts. got a great story. Nuts. You accomplished some amazing things on a big league field. One good day of work came back. And now you're like the second coolest baseball media guy in the game. <laughs> <laughs> so <laughs> you transitioned well i appreciate you coming on dude and then hey. we weren't even supposed to do this at bat but now i'm like so happy that we did it because you know this is this needs to be like documented and seen and shared uh, so it's 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 a cool moment and cap has been uh cap has been extremely gracious every time we uh we run into each other at the field i got you know i got it. i love that we're, oh, we're, get it in. we're tagging old gabe kapler yeah. In this oh, video, yeah. and we let it out, baby. Let him know. Let him know. Ploofy, hey, thank you, man, very much for having me on, brother. I appreciate you big time. It's always good to talk shop, especially with a guy who's been there, done that, plenty of dirt under his spikes. It's, uh, thank you. It's, it's refreshing, man. Love it. I appreciate it. And, um, yeah, man, you've challenged me to a wiffle ball game. So that's still. Oh, yeah. We're in oh, quarantine. Yeah. yeah. But hey, it's going to happen, baby. I just got I just got I just got the new blitz ball strike zone and everything they sent out to me. I just got it today. I got to work so, on that. All right. Mm -hmm. I got to pick up a bat. That's Step what I got to do. Yeah, buddy. We don't need to talk about the offer you sent out to, to those minor league guys. Um, you you're actually the one who's made me nervous about it because <laughs> I was confident as a as a you know what. And then I talked to you last night and you're like, you know, you better prepare. I'm like, yeah, you're right. <laughs> all right, man. Thanks for coming on, Dallas. All right, big dog.